Hello queens and welcome back. Today I'll be sharing with you guys my second flexi rise set of the year using the Curl Perfect Foaming Mousse from UV Natural. So for wash day I just went on ahead and I used some of the products that I received from them last year and I have a full review but today I used the Tangle Me Not Detangling Shampoo. It contains argon, jojoba, and wheat germ oils. It detangles a manageable hair, provides moisturizing cleansing, and a rich lather. The 3-in-1 co-wash cleansing conditioner is a favorite of mine. It contains jojoba and coconut. It cleanses, detangles, and moisturizes and I used it in conjunction with the hair mayonnaise this time because I was actually low but it worked out perfect so this is what I actually use for my wash day for this review you guys I already have a review using these products and I will leave it linked here and I will leave it listed down below in the description bar so let's get right into today's tutorial so as I stated, queens, we're going to be using the Botanical Curl Perfect Foaming Mousse from UB Natural. This mousse contains argon and coconut oils. It states that it softens, detangles, and defines, locks in, and sets styles, and adds body and shine, which it definitely does. What I love about this product is that, you guys, you can use it for a wash and go, twist out, and a rod set. So of course, for the sake of time, I simply just went on ahead and started on the back off camera. And initially, you're going to want to moisturize your scalp. That is highly important because again it's the winter months you want to make sure you winterize your hair care and you take care of your scalp and do not neglect it so once we've actually gone on ahead and moisturize our scalp I'm going to split this section into two sections here once we've tucked the other section away I'm going to take some of the curl perfect forming mousse and apply that to the entire section and you're going to see I'm going to use quite a bit of this product but I actually didn't go in as heavy as I thought I did now that I'm looking at the packaging and you just want to make sure that you get your roots as well as the ends. I detangled initially with the comb and then followed that with my smoothing detangler brush from Texture Pro and then we're going to take our of course flexi rod and I'm doing again the horseshoe method that's coined by curl days and y'all I love this method it has really helped me with my flexi rod technique and I just have a new confidence I'm so excited now I wanted to make sure that I definitely paid attention to the ends because that's very important if you're wanting to ensure that you have definition for your style and then I just took a comb and just made sure that it was just further detangled so detangling is your best friend when it comes to a flexi rod set and then I'm simply going to make sure that I smooth down the strand between my fingers as I'm wrapping it around the flexi rod and then of course we're going to bend it and then we're going to secure it and then I'm just going to continue to repeat this process um, on the remaining section you guys so that way for those who are still learning how to do flexi rod sets you can watch my video and see how I'm actually doing the horseshoe method again this method is coined by curl days and I'm so happy that I picked up this method because it actually does work and it's really easy for those who are pretty much challenged when it comes to using flexi rods or perm rod sets like myself and being that I am low maintenance I had gotten away from using a lot of styling tools and so 2018 is a whole new ball game I'm ready I have a new confidence and I'm just excited you guys so if you're wanting to just see my results then continue watching I did quickly want to mention if you guys saw my first flexi rod set for 2018 that I had saw what places I needed to strengthen on when doing my flexi rod. So you want to make sure that at the root that it is kind of taunt but not too taunt because you're wanting to make sure that it's actually secured around the flexi rod and not hanging loose so that way you can ensure that you're getting that defined you know definition for your flexi rod set. Another thing I noticed too you guys was because of the thickness of my hair I needed to use more flexi rods towards the front versus the back because in the back my hair is longer and a different texture versus the one in the front. In the front I'm more of a type 4 and in the back I'm more of a type 3 and I just wanted to explain that to you guys because that was really critical and I paid attention to that and it made the world of difference with me splitting the front section down an additional section so that way I can ensure that one my hair is securely wrapped around the flexi rod and that two I can get the most definition throughout the whole head of my hair you guys for my flexi rod set.
So once you have all your flexi rods done and secured, I actually did use my hooded dryer. This is the Golden Hot 1200. You guys got this from a local beauty supply store. And I did have it set to high and I didn't realize that. And I sat under there for about an hour, hour and a half. And then once it was fully dried, this is later on the same day, which I'm so happy about. I decided to go ahead and take my flexi rods down. Me and babe had a date night. And as you guys can see, I'm like, oh God, is this going to work? They're dry. And as you guys can tell, it did because I was so excited that it was super duper dry. And I must say my hair was not like dry, like crunchy dry. But I'm saying dry, like 100% dry for me to take down and actually style my flexi rod set. So yes, thank you to UV Natural. The Botanical Curl Perfect Foamy Mousse is the bomb. So I'm using the Repairing Oil from the Straight From Eden Collection by Cream of Nature. And I love this oil. It's lightweight and it has a very soft fragrance. And I like the shine that it gave my hair and as you guys can see I'm just I'm just shocked by the definition that I received from using this curl perfect forming mousse because again you guys know I typically don't do a lot of manipulation with my hair but I really wanted to achieve a perfect flexi rod set and I did thank you so much to UB Natural for them actually reaching out to me last year in 2017 and actually sending me their entire collection you guys in this yellow packaging so if it wasn't for them you guys I would not have a renewed confidence for a flexi rod set and I will definitely make sure that I leave everything that I use today in the video link below in the description bar for you guys to check out okay Alright you guys, so these are my results once I've taken down all the flexi rides and separated them to my liking. I didn't want to go too crazy. Um, I will today, since it's day two, I'm going to separate a little bit more in the back. And I'm just shaking my hair to try to give some volume because again, this is day one hair. You guys, I did do this on freshly washed hair, so my curls are a lot tighter. And I want to try in the future doing a flexi rod set on actually stretched or old hair. So I'm going to take my afro pick, of course, and I'm going to fluff at the roots. I'm not going to go too crazy because I don't want to, you know, cause any frizz or anything like that. Because I had barely any frizz, which was awesome 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 and you guys i just love my results my hair is just so shiny it's bouncy it's healthy it's not crunchy it's not weighed down i mean this is like one of the perfect curl forming mousses that you can pick up so i'm simply going to take some of my edge gel from silk elements apply that on my edges and of course kind of slick those down a little bit they were looking kind of cray cray and then again I'm just going to place my curls where I want them so hopefully over the next couple of days my hair will get a little bit bigger because I love big hair I'm not used to small hair like I have right here but I'm loving the results it's not that big of a deal I'm just so happy with my results so queens I thank each of you for hanging out with me today make sure to like comment and definitely subscribe and I'll see you guys in a future video Bye, queens. Mwah. For this life, I cannot change. In the hills, deep off in the main. Eminem, sweet like candy cane.